Okay, part two is going to be coming from Yahshua or Yeshua coming YouTube channel. Okay, progress of catastrophic event night uh, right before the rapture. So I want you to check out this reply on the first the first uh, comment on this channel. This is the video. Okay, Yeshua coming channel. I know I'm on the fuzzy camera, you guys. So the first comment and the reply, it, it, it really tied into what I'm saying on part one about the things that are going to happen in the sky and, and, and just trying to figure out the truth of what's going to play out. Let's see. Okay, this is the reply. He says, uh, I'm just going to read it since it's so fuzzy. But he says, uh, the, or they want everyone in their house so that no one looks up and sees Yahshua Jesus coming, right? So the lady on the channel replies, Brother in Yahshua or Yeshua Christ, they should pay attention to look up the sky. Other than they will be left behind and they will receive visitation of UFO and aliens to cover up the rapture. Time to look up to the sky and pay attention of what is coming upon us. Yeshua Christ mentioned mentioned to us through Book of Matthew 24 and 25, Watch and be ready. As likewise, five virgins, peace be with you and your family. Be ready to be raptured. Shalom. And I, I think I've talked to her before. I'm not sure. I, I think I might have asked her if the, if the rapture she is referring to is it physical or spiritual, which I can't remember what we talked about, but it doesn't even matter because we are taking off this flesh, you guys. This Everything that's going on on earth is the culmination of the close of this age and the age to come. We're going on to the spiritual age where we're not physical anymore. We're in our spiritual body. And then even that gets closed until the our, until we go to the realm of eternity and we, we're going on into it's like being taken all back up into Yahweh like we're all Yahweh anyway right think about him just like absorbing himself right back into himself so his coming is going to be terrible to the the people that are off in their vibration who are negative entities because he is a consuming fire our, our Lord is a consuming fire right so he he is the lake of fire that they're going to spend eternity in so anyway so the uh the what she's saying is that they're going to use ufos and aliens to cover up rapture so i was thinking about that say if people are missing or people disappear i've i've, I've read that before that they want every because you got to think why are we really all in our houses why do they really really want everyone away now i know the tanks and stuff are coming they're already in some cities but why do they want everyone away that would be a perfect excuse to be like oh there was a there's an alien uh abducted people or there's some kind of alien rapture to cover up a spiritual rapture whether it be I don't know if it's people's physical physical flesh getting taken. I'm not saying all that. But even if it was people just by their spirit, even leaving their bodies behind and their spirit being taken away, or up everyone making our exit. But uh, we are at the, the the close of the age. I'll uh, also link the Elohim book and try to find the spot and page where they talk about um, us being at the close of this age. That this is the close of the of the physical age. Because remember, even the earth has her end. Even the physical earth has to get rolled up, and we can't think that this goes on and on forever. Now we've we've the Satan has been exposed, and he's exposed at the close of every age, and uh, we we see we see Heli Weird and everything from the UN, the Vatican, everything down for what it is that it is Satan's kingdom in in, in the flesh. So the adversary the adversary is exposed, right? So we we are at the culmination. I just want to say that to you guys that prepare yourself and be at peace with leaving the flesh leaving this behind leaving this earth school this soul school or this matrix this dream behind you're yahweh i'm yahweh there is none else whether it be yahweh and ignorance people that they don't, don't even know they're yahweh living living a life living a life of iniquity doing everything that's abominable and against the law of spirit law against the law of nature or people that are living in righteousness with good hearts all you good people out there speaking the truth see through the matrix reloaded all you good people that are uh, that are that are standing up and speaking from your heart, and, uh, and and standing up against the lies that are on that Satan cube television, you guys. But uh, all that to say, to chime in what you think. Chime in your experiences, anything you've seen in the skies. And I know my husband has seen things. Whether you've dreamed dreams, speak about whatever experience you have and add to it, because I, I that's my prediction. I, I don't want to act like I know what's going on, as far as being boastful or anything. But I feel like that's the the next step beyond the whole stupid Lyris uh plan demonic pandemic going on that uh the next thing we're gonna see is soldiers tanks in the streets and UFOs in the sky and I told you what I think the manifestations will be 
So, all right, the battery's going dead and it's late. I hope you guys have a good night. Chime in what you think. I'm sorry it's kind of a messy presentation, but I will link all three of these Nibiru videos from Chief Micah's channel, and I'll link the Yeshua channel a video. I'll put it in the Two Sun playlist in the comments. If you're one of the first one or two views and then nothing's in the comment section, it's just because I haven't got time to link it yet. I'm doing, I'll do it as fast as I absolutely can. It might load up faster than I can link it before you view it. So if you don't see anything comments, just come back and you'll see all the links to the red, the red moon, the night that I recorded the red moon and the pink star and uh, anything else that I see that needs to tie into this subject of what's going to come next. Soldiers, tanks, and UFOs. Okay, you guys, peace. Have a good night.